Hi everyone, Yvonne Heath here with Love Your Life to Death. In my nursing career and in my life, I had many mentors that influenced me. Some I met and some I learned about. And of course, we all know that I love Patch Adams. And another person who uh, influenced my life from a distance was Dr. Elizabeth Kubler-Ross who wrote the book on death and dying and um, really was a pioneer, one of the pioneers in the hospice palliative care movement and starting conversations with uh, people who were dying and, um, and she really was a trailblazer. And um, she had created the five stages of grief or wrote about them in her book and the whole world just took those five stages and ran with them and uh, and thought that was all the work she had done. That's all I ever learned in nursing school. And um, there was just so much more to that. And to this day, many pe people believe that there are five stages of grief and then others argued that there weren't actually only five stages of grief. And that wasn't what she meant at all. What she was saying was that grief was complex and it wasn't linear and there's just so much more to all of her work. And I have had the privilege of connecting with her son, Ken Ross. He is a wonderful, amazing human being who uh, founded the Elizabeth Kubler-Ross Foundation to teach the world uh, about everything that her, his mother brought. And she wrote over 24 books. I had no idea. She started hospices. She did so many things. And so I'm sharing here two links to my real life talk show because I had the absolute pleasure of having two great conversations with Ken about his life and his mother's legacy. And you can also learn so much more at, um, at their website, uh, elizabethkubler-rossfoundation.org, which we'll share the link. So I would encourage you to watch the shows, share the shows. I've learned so much, and apparently I have a lot more to learn about Dr. Elizabeth Kubler-Ross's wonderful work, and I have a lot of books to read. So thanks everyone, happy reading, and uh, I, I encourage you to watch the shows. Bye for now.